Good morning guys, today is gonna be an amazing day. I am super happy to be back with you guys on this new vlog. I decided to do this vlog and share everything with you, especially now that we're getting ready to go to the festival for the second time. I just wanted to show you everything that I normally do before I go to a big event. This is a big, big event, so I normally have a routine. I go to the dermatologist, I do something in my hair, take care of my body, and I just have a routine that I know that it has worked for years. And this time I wanted to share this routine and this behind the scenes of the preparation and what it takes for me to get ready to go to a big event like this. You guys are gonna come with me throughout the day and I'm gonna show you exactly what I do. We're gonna be around a lot of cameras, it's gonna be a lot of work, so you have to be ready physically, emotionally, and mentally for this. I just left the house and our first stop will be to go to my beloved dermatologist. She is amazing. Her name is Dr. B, Dr. Berta Baum. And we are gonna do today the famous vampire facial. This is one of my favorite facial treatments that I've done throughout the years that I know that it's so beneficial for your skin. It's a little traumatic. You guys are gonna see it today. I just wanna show you my skin before. We might bleed a little bit. You see the texture that I have right now. I hope you can see it. This is a very vulnerable moment. I just want you to see the truth of everything and what we do, guys. This is the reality of the things we do to look super fresh, super good. This is a treatment that is non-invasive and I will 100% recommend, of course, with somebody who is a professional and who knows what they're doing. Okay, guys, we're here at the clinic and I just want to show you how pretty this clinic is. I am absolutely in love. With this new clinic that's my doctor really excited and by the way guys i'm trying the new mini microphone that we got for the videos and i want to see if there's a big difference i haven't checked this is my outfit for the day like very sporty chic super sporty look and then i have this super glam gucci bag that i love okay guys we're here and we have adri here she's gonna be applying the numbing cream all over the face and we have requested a thick layer of numbing cream so nothing hurts and i'm gonna show you guys throughout the whole process there she comes i see you we're gonna start so adri this is the numbing cream right yes. okay let me take my glasses off so i'll leave this on like 40 minutes to an hour depending on how she's feeling and then we'll go ahead and do the treatment and then we'll show you guys when we start it's been a while since the last time i did it and i know the difference in my in my skin so there's no product no treatment that i've done that is so good as this one so i'm excited to show you again but yeah this is the numbing cream we have our numbing cream and i know it looks really scary now they're gonna come and they're gonna take my blood because they have to centrifugate my blood and take the plasma out of the blood and i think they're gonna inject it this time sometimes i've done it and they put it just on top of the skin here's my love and she came ready to make us suffer <laughs> We're not suffering today, we're just doing a little blood draw. So this is our setup here that we have for PRP. This is our tube where we collect the blood and then we spin it down and at the top you'll see later that the PRP sits at the top and that's what we extract and we use it for different applications on the face. So today we're going to do a little blood draw. We're going to start with alcohol to clean the area. We have our butterfly needle so it's way more comfortable and easier for our patients and a little tourniquet for some pressure so that way we can get the optimum amount of blood out. My goodness, so excited and scary. <laughs> so we're cleaning out the skin, guys. I don't even get scared anymore. I love my blood <laughs> being taken out. 
Look at my vein. It's ready it's to ready. get some plasma. <laughs> wow. She's hydrated. Oh. Make a test for me. I am hydrated. That's what it means. Yes, <gasps> I am so proud of myself. <laughs> this has been my journey, like drinking more water and yes. So we're okay, here we go. A little pinch here. One, two, three into the vein. Perfect. Didn't hurt. And now we collect the blood. How many? I was going to say liters, but <laughs> <laughs> it's not that much, guys. Like how much blood? Oh, we're supposed to get. Um, with one full tube, we'll get about 60 cc's of the PRP. Are we feeling like injecting or? <laughs> Depends on I the mood. I think we can inject some, a little injectable, give her a nice glow, maybe a little aqua gold, make her skin nice and filtered. Meanwhile, I'm going to show you a little bit of the clinic. I want to give you like a clinic tour. And this is my favorite part. The office because you have this station you can do your makeup you can wash your face like do you know everything that you have to do before starting your day and i think oh oh my goodness look at all the makeup that we have here of course i'm not gonna be putting it on because i'm gonna do this treatment but you have makeup you have your creams it's just amazing and so convenient address back and she came with the plasma wow the blood has separated from mm -hmm. the plasma and we're gonna extract it oh my goodness thanks guys mm -hmm. this is plasma platelet rich plasma we have more there we basically are now going to use it as growth factors into her skin so we're going to do a little bit of her nasal labia folds as well as around her eyes and make sure that she gets that extra glow with some microneedling and aqua gold on top. So we're gonna do a little bit of tiny pinching here. So tiny pinch. Put up on her skin's looking great. Thanks to you. Uh, <laughs> and we're gonna do her other fold. Do three small little pinch. Okay, I feel like the whole point is make it to make it bleed, creating a lot of trauma, mm -hmm. but it's okay, we have ah, we have the nummy cream. <laughs> okay, here we go, guys. I'm gonna put a little bit of plasma to begin with. And this is creating little channels of micro trauma into your skin. And the idea with that is that we basically promote collagen production by the repair that happens in the skin. Also, we're kind of like getting new skin in all those areas where there's damage. So you'll notice a change in the skin tone. You get like an immediate glow. It's a really nice treatment and it has very little downtime, like a couple of days of your rest, like a tomato. Yeah. Kind of like a sunburn type of redness and then it goes away. I love when you do it there by the full seat, oh, by yeah. the nasal. Yeah. Because we are we normally have so much texture there. Yeah. And this machine literally blurs the skin. It's insane. You sometimes underestimate how good my skin is on skin because it's such a you know simple procedure. But again, you want to do it with someone that knows what they're doing because they've seen horrible results if they don't know what they're doing in terms of like tracking on the skin where it looks almost like there's like scratches on the skin because they don't know how to like move the device or or they use things to glide the device that are not made to be inserted into the skin oh wow so ideally you want to use things that are made to be injected into your skin like plasma which is very natural, PRS, um, or just in general, like chronic stomach acid that is made to be injected into your skin, things like that, hyaluronic acid, but the one that comes in injectables, not the regular hyaluronic acid, because then you're inserting that into the patient's skin, and you don't know how that is going to react. After so many people have insane 
changes oh. in their skin. Like oh, if you suffer from acne and you have scars everywhere. Oh, it's huge. The plasma, it's the plasma now, the microneedling yeah. literally gives you a new face. Yeah. yeah. It's literally. insane. Yeah. How many times would you recommend so to when do patients this? are like you, that you have beautiful skin and you don't need much, obviously, you know, we can do like three treatments once a month so that you can get a nice glow and a nice result. But after one treatment, you'll see the change. Difference, yeah. Um, but as the patients have more scarring, we may recommend six treatments where we go like a little deeper on the scar area. Um, and sometimes combined with other scar treatments. He's doing super good. I don't even feel it. Ah, awesome. Okay, we're ready for the 3.5. Ah. No, let's do it. <laughs> Am I bleeding or not? Yeah. Ah, nah. uh, a lot? No. Yeah. yeah. It's yeah. funny when the numbing cream starts wearing off. And you start seeing the skin the is tightening. waking up yeah. and you're like, yeah. It was a lot. You know how it feels? It's like when you put egg white uh -huh. on your skin. Yeah. And it's super tight. Yeah, it, that's how it feels. It's Is it true that egg white has a lot of plasma? Or that's just like a mid? I know, it has a lot of real <laughs> thing. I don't know if it has a lot of plasma specifically, but you know, it definitely has a lot of protein in it. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, I was not expecting that. I don't even feel anything, guys. Oh my god. We're gonna uh -huh. do the aqua gold okay. on top. Right now, the channels are open, and this also has little tiny needles. So, the idea with this is we create our own cocktail. I'm just priming it so it's ready to be injected. Creator cocktail in this case, we added hyaluronic acid, Botox. It's all for the skin. So, that's gonna help also with the open pores. It's gonna help give you almost like an extra glow to the skin. And right now what we're doing is we're stamping it into her skin so that it penetrates into that deeper dermis so you can see the product coming up. And that combined with the plasma is gonna be absorbed by her skin and it's gonna give her a nice glow. It's gonna help with open pores. It's gonna help with redness. Um, if she has any issues with redness, Botox also helps with like rosacea on the skin. So it's different than the one that we put on the muscles because we're putting it only on the skin and it's going to help with that look up. Okay. It really helps with superficial lines. So we do it in this area where these lines can be a little hard to treat. Um, and then we just keep doing it all throughout like three times. and. We also added hyaluronic acid, so it's gonna give like that dewy appearance to the skin, very hydrated. So she's gonna look as if she has like a little Instagram filter all the time. Burns just nice, right. a little bit. No, yeah. just a little bit. Amazing. So strong, right? guys. I am brave. <laughs> So on the neck, you want to make sure you never do the treatments as strong as the face because there's not as many sebaceous glands there, so the recovery is going to be longer and obviously you cannot take as much energy and, and strength as the face. Here's some recommendations, right? Yes. So we give this to all of our patients that get microneedling so that you know about the aftercare. Try not to wear makeup in the next 24 hours if you can, at least not tonight. Um, no air exercising? Yeah. Ideally no. not on the day that we do it, like right after. No. You can do it later, but definitely like we want to make sure that whatever we put into your skin gets absorbed correctly and it doesn't get sweat out. Okay. And then if you have any questions in between, you call me and I can't wait to see pictures. I love you so much. You're the best. So happy to see you. And I'll send you pictures yes. when this is yes. glowing. I love it. Love you, dog. Bye. Bye. Dog. She's the best. We're back in the car. We just left the doctor's office. And look how red I am. By the way, I'm holding the microphone. It is so cute. Today, we have to run uh, a couple more errands. I have to pick up some clothes. I have to ship some uh, packages. And I also have a nail appointment because look at this. 
These are my real nails, guys, by the way. I had two that they broke because I was riding the horse and I did some movement that they broke. So I'm gonna cut them all really short because it's, it's not comfortable to have such a long nails. And I'm also doing the natural, regular manicure. I don't wanna do more gel because it's really damaging for your skin. Tomorrow we have her appointment. We're gonna go to Adrian, the most amazing hairstylist in the world. Like I don't let anyone touch my hair. I only go to him because he's really the best. And even though I can be in Paris, I can be in Milan, I can be anywhere in the world. And believe me, I have met great hairstylists who offer me you know all their services just to just to you know to have like a nice gesture with me but i trust my hair with adrian so we're doing that tomorrow because i'm gonna have a new look but we're gonna go for a more natural look for the summer because now i have like this balayage and in the summer this uh, it might be too much it might be too too crazy to maintain so we're gonna go for a more natural look we get a fresh hair color and you guys are gonna come with me to that as well i have arrived to the nail salon oh my god i look so funny i look like a like a secret service person i'm undercover another cover agent on vacation we're here for the nails guys and I'll show you what I'm gonna do, but it's almost the same what I have right now. I like it very elegant, very simple, not too much on the nails, something that matches with everything and that if something happens, you will see like a piece of nail polish falling off of my nail. So let's see what we can do. And I know it's gonna be pretty. Guys, I lied. These chrome ones are amazing. This pinkish nude. These ones are so nice. Well, hello guys. This is the day after my facial. And you can see how my skin is feeling. You can see how it's reacting to the treatment. Of course, it's, you know, it's a little red and everything, but this will go away in maximum two days. I just have to be using sunscreen and protecting myself a lot from the sun and like anything too aggressive to the skin. For example, no acids, no strong toners or cream. So it just, it just needs moisturizing and that's it. But it's feeling great, it doesn't hurt. It feels so soft. We are here the day after, and today we have to do a lot of things. We're getting our hair done. As I told you, I'm gonna do a more uh, natural color for the summer, and especially for the festival, because I want it to be like really classy and elegant. And yeah, that's what we're doing this afternoon. But before, we have to finish packing for a trip that I have to Colombia before to Cannes. Today, I'm flying to North Carolina and then I have to leave my luggage for Colombia ready and then also the luggage for Europe ready. So I have to leave two big luggages ready today and then pack the one I'm taking to North Carolina tonight. So it's gonna be a lot of packing. You guys are gonna see a little bit of that. The things that I'm gonna take, especially to Colombia, Colombia and to can. I just want you to see that there is nothing glamorous about packing three bags. Oh my goodness, there's nothing glamorous about packing three bags at once for different trips. Like this is pure chaos. Clothes everywhere, boxes everywhere, shoes everywhere, mess everywhere. There is nothing glamorous about these guys. This is what it looks like every time I have to pack for different trips at the same time. Because the only time I have when I come back is just to come back to the house and pick up the new luggage. There is more here. Just wanted you to see. <laughs> but it's gonna be fine. This is the bag for North Carolina. This is the mess that I have to put in the bag for Cannes. And this is the bag for Colombia. Let's do this, guys. 
Okay guys, look at this. Of course, I still have this mess, but at this I don't need with me. So somebody's gonna come and help me and pick it up and organize it. But look at the difference. Much better, still a lot of mess here, but these are empty boxes. And these are gonna be picked up and thrown away. Okay, so here's my luggage for North Carolina. This is my handbag, my carry-on, and this, gonna, this is gonna be the big luggage. Albert Einstein, I love this picture. Love is the answer. I know, Albert, I know. I have all the mess here. <laughs> The mess has to go somewhere, guys, but this is gonna be all hanged uh, in the closet. The makeup is gonna be picked up, so I don't have to worry about it. And here are the other two suitcases. This one will be for Can. This one with the carry-on is gonna be for Colombia, and then when I come back, I'll take the same carry-on for Can. And what I have here is just like a light for filming all the connectors that don't work in the United States. I have it here, that's my iPhone charger. And this is the steamer, just in case. I know hotels have steamers, but you know, I just wanna take my stuff. Guys, we made it. Here I am with my favorite one. Hola, mi Adri, como estas? Adri, he's the best, guys. I'm gonna link his uh, page here so you can go and follow him. He's literally like the number one. I never let anyone touch my hair if it's not him. Cierto, amor? Cierto. Cierto. And he's from Mexico. <laughs> but yeah, guys, we made it. We packed everything. So now we're doing our hair and we go to the airport. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> We should be on our way. Once again, walk on our We just woke up. We are in North Carolina. This is a quick update from my skin. And I'm feeling all over the face that means it's working that means we're getting new skin This is a quick update of my skin. It's looking really, really weird. We are ready to go. Look how pretty this suitcase is. We are back home, back in Miami, and I didn't get a chance to show you how the final result of my new hair look was but here you have it it's so beautiful guys i love it it's super 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 natural but still has some highlights you can see some blonde but very minimal and i love it because it's super elegant and it's gonna be the right hair for the summer because when i'm too blonde and summer hits it's it's not good i love this hair thank you so much to adrian he is amazing i love him so much you saw him guys he's so sweet and yeah this is this is my new look i love it
much more natural. This is actually very similar to my Rio Hill color. Although I was born with blonde hair, and I'm gonna put a picture right here so you guys believe me. But this is very um, natural and I love it because it's gonna be way easier to style. And I was actually styling it with the Dyson. Before I leave, I would like to finish this video with an unboxing. What do we have this time here? I love unboxings, guys. I have so many packages that I wanna open in front of you guys. But this is the unboxing for this video and it's makeup again. Thank you so much to Laura Mercier and Box Some because they sent us some like super nice goodies. Look at this palette. I'm gonna show you like real quick what it is. We have this Box Some palette. Wow. It's actually eyeshadow as well. I think it's all in one. Really, really cute. Laura Mercier, some powder. This is the famous powder from her, although it has a different uh, packaging. Oh, it says Ultra Blur. It's, I really want to try it because the other one, I'm not really a fan of the other uh, Laura Mercier setting powder, but I'm really curious about this one. Blush from Laura Mercier. I've never tried blushes from Laura Mercier. This is gorgeous, guys. This is so pretty. I want to see if it has a brush. This one doesn't have it. Another blush. This is more like a peachy, more like a curly. We have some mascara from La Mercier. I love this uh, famous lip things by Boxum. Although I don't buy them very often because last time I tried one, it was really plumping. It was burning a little bit, but I'm curious about these ones. This plump shot, I'm gonna have to try it. <gasps> we have a P1. Really creamy. It's minty as well. It's a lip serum. Although the color it might be too light for my skin tone. What I like is that I don't feel anything plumping with this lip serum. I don't feel that my lips are burning or anything like that. This is cute. It might be too light for my skin complexion. So I might give this to uh, one of my sisters. What is this? This is another lipstick. This is from Laura Mercier. Rouge à l'oeuvre. Mmm, it's gonna be a great color for the summer. We have some more Laura Mercier Tinted Moisturizer Blush. Oh my god, I'm so excited about this one. This I've seen um, a couple of times. It comes like this and it's Tinted Moisturizer Blush. Let's try with our fingers. I actually don't like when people apply things with their hands just like randomly and I'm just doing it right now. So I'm like a bad example so beautiful and so easy to apply it literally took me two seconds this i love thank you Laura mercier and we have some more stuff hey guys i just wanted to finish this video this vlog with some unboxing i know you guys love to see the things that i buy the things that i get the things that uh brands give me and i am super super grateful for all the brands that send me stuff for all the sponsors that i have this vlog was super entertaining for me to film because i really enjoyed showing you the reality of all the things that i normally do before a big event and this was just like a little bit of some of the things that i've done but there are many things that I've done that I would like to share with you guys let me know in the comments if you want to see more of those videos I'll see you in the next vlog which is coming I believe in a couple of days so you have to stay tuned and follow this channel so you don't miss out anything also follow my TikTok I'm gonna leave it down below and my Instagram because I post a lot on Instagram and you don't want to miss anything thank you so much guys I love you and see you next time.